Matthew Doyle here for Autodesk with the new features in Stingray 1.1. We've done a lot to improve the UI and create more intuitive workflows in Stingray. This makes level building a more efficient process. The asset browser has been improved with new features such as right click additions, case sensitive search toggle, toggleable filters, and support for moving multiple objects from folder to folder at the same time. New drag and drop interactions allow you to quickly change materials on objects in your level using the asset browser. Objects can be organized in your scene using the new layer tool. Layers can be hidden or even frozen. And explore filters make it easier to find specific types of objects in your levels. The new performance HUD provides quick visual debugging information in the 3D viewport, including frames per second, memory stats, Lua performance, and much more. We've also improved the animation controller workflow the animation controller window now provides more visual feedback, as well as a greater level of interaction. You can drag and drop animation states into groups or layers in the tree view now. Timeline interaction has been significantly improved, allowing for the movement, cloning, and copying and pasting of markers. And events from the sound bank property editor can be dragged and dropped onto the timeline. Audio sources in your level can be previewed live per viewport now. And we've added support for Xbox XMA encoding as well as updated WY's SDK support. Stingray now fully supports Android devices equipped with Qualcomm Adreno 330 and 420 chipsets. These GPUs are very common and found in many Android-based mobile devices. Support for Oculus Rift's 0.7 SDK has also been added, providing the most up-to-date VR experience in Stingray, including better performance and stability, as well as the new direct driver mode for improved latency. Stingray continues to push the limits of visual fidelity by adding new post effects and shaders. Many of the screen space effects found in the shading environment have been improved, including better performance and ghosting reduction for screen space ambient occlusion, as well as a new option in screen space reflections that allows you to bend reflection rays near the edge of the screen. New refraction and subsurface scattering options have been added to the Stingray shader effects material, providing more compelling translucency options for objects such as glass, human skin, lit candles, and more. Finally, we've added V-Ray material support, allowing for the import of texture maps from V-Ray materials in 3ds Max or Maya. Keep track of Stingray updates with the improved games launcher. Get notified directly from Autodesk in the launcher and easily download and install updates. Get Stingray today and start your journey.